Good morning everyone. So today is day 7 of the Luzon White Quarantine or Lockdown as how others would, wanna, would like to call it. Um, I want to use this time to be very productive by of course working, you know, um, still doing my job from home and at the same time spending more time and reading the word and um, using my social media as a platform to share it to others. With that, I just want to share my devotion, devotion to you all. Um, I hope this can somehow bring, you know, hope, bring encouragement to whoever's watching this or whoever's listening or, you know, um, hearing um, the message in this video. With everything that's happening across the globe today, um, it's so easy to lose heart and tremble with fear thinking about um, what's going to happen tomorrow, what's going to happen next week, what's going to happen next month, is this the end of it all? When will this all end? Not to mention the, I mean, not to mention how social media adds drama to, to what seems to be a profound item or a profound issue, which makes everybody's emotion, you know, rage, um, causing us to really, you know, throw stones at each other um, instead of um, uplifting each other. We end up fighting for what we know is right. And this is all because of how social media tries to picture the situation to everybody. I was reading through the book of Philippians and it says in Philippians chapter 3 verses 7 and 8, But Christ has shown me that what I once thought was valuable is worthless. Nothing is as wonderful as knowing Christ, my Lord. I have given up everything else and counted all as garbage. I find this really relevant to what's happening now um, you know we can't go out we can't go to the mall we can't eat or drink whatever we were craving for um, our basic necessities are very much limited you know the life that once was full of color and volume suddenly became you know black and white and suddenly turned into this uncertain face and we all thought that this is what life is all about but Paul in his letter made an unwavering statement saying that nothing is as wonderful as knowing Christ Jesus my Lord because you know with Christ there can be peace in our hearts and with Christ there is an unexplainable joy with Christ there can be an assurance that at the end of this is just the beginning of you know of an even better life for everybody with Christ there is hope with Christ there is there is love there is mercy there's grace there's forgiveness so um, I just hope that in the midst of uncertain times we all find it in our hearts to reconnect to the author of this life that's all have a great day and God bless you